something that's good, I want to make that for myself. So, I do that through my art. Oh gosh. Like this is a piece that I made in my fiber art class. Soft, amazing. 
sewing. I don't have a sewing machine. The last time I used a sewing machine was literally home ec in middle school and I did like a stuffed animal sewing unit and that was like my favorite one. Then I did like the mom babying one where you literally have to take care of a baby. That shit was a lot of work. <laughs> like it was kind of a fun challenge at times but it, it didn't relax me but like making a stuffed animal and sewing was very relaxing so it's like something I've done for my entire life pretty much not my whole life that's so dramatic since that point whenever I experimented with needle and thread and making something that like clicked for me and in this fiber art class that I took last semester that's now inspiring my current work that I'm doing right now and it fits into my purpose it fits into this whole like relaxation and calming kind of energy that I feel I embody and it's a good characteristic that I have to like offer people like just me sitting and being quiet and me being in my own energy people feel comforted and people feel at home and relaxed so that is just a little bit about me let's get another fabric next is this kind of like shrek so soft. It's like a t-shirt material. Oh my gosh, wait. This would be so cute if I turned it into like a little flowy tank top or like, I don't even know. I've never made clothes, but I really would love to just have a fiber art studio and collect fabrics because I already do that with thrifting. Like, I will show you guys my clothes at some point. I never wear them in videos, like rarely, but they're like my special art clothes and I look at them and they're like hanging on the clothing rack and I play around with like the color palette and the color scheme so right now my thing is green and purple but more of a heavy emphasis on green so that's why my projects right now are green so I went to the store and got a bunch of fabrics that I thought looked good together in like a color palette sense already saw this slightly but it's just like a really worn out pillowcase but it, there's something so relaxing and like nostalgic about this feeling kind of like the inside of a sweatshirt or like pajamas like as a little kid you know like you get worn out pjs and you're not really complaining about the texture of it all that much although maybe you are sensitive to but I feel like as a kid you just don't care you're more carefree and this is the other thing that I love about fiber art and like doing this stuff it's like fiber art can be seen as a very feminine and soft profession or soft like area but like it's true it is and it all ties back to like the womb and like comfort and safety and like all this stuff so I hope you guys are enjoying this Next is this beautiful silk table runner. Look at that. I don't think I'm going to unroll the whole thing because it's just going to be a mess, but look. How freaking fun is that? Like, I love collecting fabrics and textures and all kinds of stuff. So this is going to look so beautiful. It's like rich, luxurious. So like the materials that I use also has to do with like the message. Like everything I got is green, gold, silver, and it's supposed to be like riches, money, value, wealth. And my idea is love is my currency. So I'm like challenging that idea that money is like the more important thing and it's the more valuable thing because I disagree. I think love and just that feeling in your heart and like experiencing life from a lens of love like I would much rather experience life through a lens of love compassion understanding care just like people slowing down and like making sure like everyone's good and like check in on each other and like creating a safe space for each other whenever we're interacting imagine like a pure bliss, a pure heaven. That's the type of world that I 
use it in this money related one or not this might be like the insert color so that it's not just like all this like rich green like it's gonna have like this accent of like calming and little do y'all hear these drunk boys outside oh my gosh they're the whole start. 